Sports Unplugged brought to you by Wingstop. Introducing the Louisiana Rub, the newest flavor addition to the Wingstop family. It's a crispy, dry rub wing with a unique blend of seasonings and spices. So go to your nearest Wingstop, grab up some wings, and they have these wonderful, wonderful rolls. Uh, yeast bread. Oh my God. Yeast rolls. Oh. Yeast man. rolls. Oh, Wingstop, y'all did it with the yeast, yeast rolls. Yeast rolls. Oh. Please believe that. Get sauced and toss at Wingstop and then grab a bun. Hey, man, come on. Sign me up. Get sauced and tossed at Wingstop, then grab a bun. <laughs> Stop playing. Man. Can't write this. <laughs> who, who does that? Hey, still, man, more predictions. Still on the NFL. Let's go into the NFC right now. Uh, in a division that is chaotic every year of the NFC East, I think a team that has to do it right now, well, it's two teams, actually, that have to do it right now. Uh, one would be the Cow Bums, their windows closing. Mm-hmm. But I think the Eagles, this is this their, their year, they're going to uh, win the NFC East. Mike Vick has got to stay healthy. He's I don't know what it is, but he finds a way to get racked up uh, every year. Um, it is uh, style of play. It is stand the pocket. Five eleven, five yeah. six foot. Yeah, one eighty. Uh, right. one buck eighty. Yeah. Uh, with not a trash protector on for some yeah. reason. So, I, 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 but uh, I think the Eagles or rib protector. I think the Eagles will win the NFC East. I NFC. got the Giants, and, and the thing about it is, um, the funny thing is, last year I picked the Giants to win the Super Bowl. Okay. And I was just going wow. out on a. I was no, I was just going out on a limb. I'm just saying, you know what? Watch this and be the Giants. I'm, I'm going with the Giants. And I, when they got to the playoffs, I was like, Oh, they gonna really? Do I'm like, really yeah. Do and I told y'all, <laughs> I've been with the Giants from the beginning. I knew they were gonna do. No, but this year, you know, the the funny thing about the Giants is they usually find a way to screw up. They're, they're wow. the they're the they they're they're the, the, the Chargers of the NFC. But for some reason, they get into the playoffs. I, I think the Giants. Because uh, the Giants will go on winning yeah. streaks and, and then, then they'll, they'll lose, lose four or five to games. like teams that they have no way in the world they should lose to. Exactly. And then, and then at then the end. they in the playoffs and just stomp people's brains. Right. And then out. they'll win like the last three games. Oh, we made the playoffs 9 and 7. Now nah, nah, it's a problem. And then teams like, oh, well, they're 9 and 7. We'll get them up out of here. Yeah. And then the next thing you know. The Giants in the playoffs have always been a the tough Giants out. are bed bugs. They can't get rid of them. They're so tiny, though, and annoying. But, but this year, I think I think this year, if they put the whole, if they can put the whole championship behind them and, and play for this season, I think that the Giants can. Um, Which they've done before. I don't think that should be a problem. No, they sucked after they won the championship yeah. last time. But I'm, I, I think. Oh, they put it way behind. Yeah, but they, <laughs> oh, they still, oh, they're, they're still partying. But I think that this year, I think they can actually. Uh, continue what they were doing at the end of the year. I think their defensive. I, I agree with you. I think their defensive line always gives front them a seven. Chance. Their front seven. Yes, is awesome. Uh, I'm hoping Victor Cruz. I picked him up on my fantasy team. Uh, I'm hoping Victor Cruz continues to do what he did just, last year. I just think the Eagles have too many weapons. I, I think Deshaun. They had a Jackson, lot of weapons last year too. Yeah, but Deshaun Jackson wasn't focused. He said it himself. Oh, that's right. That's right. Jeremy, I forgot. Uh, Deshaun Jackson's in the play this year. He yeah, said, he got okay. paid. Okay, got gotcha. you. I mean, got well, you know. Uh, thank you, Deshaun. Deshaun, Jeremy, thank you. Jeremy Macklin sometimes had a case of the Gator Arms. And uh, and then he had just a case of something. <laughs> right, right. Like, what the hell was wrong? <laughs> I was like, just, he's like, he has mono. Okay, yeah. that's not mono. You know, the last time what we the, heard, I was like, what the hell is this? I mean, when we saw the Magic Johnson thing, <laughs> right. they kept putting flu. Right. <laughs> what do you got? He has a, a head cold. Yeah, he has no, a head cold. No, head cold he can head play Head cold through. for two weeks? Right. But uh, going to the Cowboys, you know. <sighs> I think they're the most overrated team. And my man, at Mike B. The Cool, is going to get mad at me. They've been the most overhyped team. In they're the Cowboys. The they're a mayor's team. They're, I get they're, it. They're, they've been overrated since, since Emmitt had, Smith was there. They've had Like right when, when we're done. They've had studs on both sides of the ball, mm-hmm. and I have, I have only won one playoff game. Can you trust a wide receiver that, need the, that needs a babysitter, that requests a babysitter? Can you Can trust? you trust a wide receiver that smacks his mama? <laughs> a man beat up his mama. <laughs> that I'm, I, I mean, it gets no worse than that. Yeah, nah, it doesn't. When if you, you when grab you have, your – I don't care what my mama does to me. If far short – uh, trying to stab me or somehow defend myself. Right. But to grab your mama up in a movie <laughs> tie hole, <laughs> that ain't right, B. <laughs> your mama can slap you across the face. This is my- and I'm going to walk away. I'm going to get out because that's mama. <laughs> right. Mama might have been on crack. A little messed up. Okay, mama, you're on crack. I want to get you some help. I love you. 
I'm going to leave. I'm not going to yeah. wrinkle her shirt up underneath yeah. her chin. <laughs> Just don't do that to your mama, man. <laughs> like, you don't do that. Uh, and and, uh, I, and Austin, and, uh, uh, Miles Austin, which I said this. Can he stay healthy this year? And he's hit a ceiling. Mm-hmm. He's not gonna get any better. Nope, he is where he, he is. What he is, and if he, uh, he can your, only go downhill from what's here. What's your running back situation? Like? Well, Demarco Murray, I do like. Again, if he stays healthy, Felix Jones, uh, yeah, big disappointment. Jason Witten might not play for for Jordan a while. Rickerea. And that defense, once again, like that, that outside of the, outside closing. of Demarcus Ware, Washington Redskins, they're gonna be rookie quarterback. Interesting, interesting to watch. Your receivers are too tiny. Please get a tall receiver. Oh, my God. Everybody no, 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 no. Learn from us. Yes. We've had tiny receivers for the last three or Bunch four years. Bunch of tiny guys. And I'm and sorry. And we see what it looks like when you have someone I, that over six foot I tall. I love Roy Helu, but it's not going to get it. Nope. Not you at all. Get you a solid now, running game back. Now, so I have the Giants. You have the Eagles. I just, like I said, Michael Vick, him getting hurt. I don't, and, I, and it shifts the balance, but I still like the Eagles. And I hope, and I hope, and I like that pass rush too. Babbin and company get. And out I hope Andy Reid keeps his job too. Yes, I, I do. I hope, I hope he keeps Longest his job. Longest tenured coach in the NFL. Who are you gonna go team? get? Who are you gonna go get? Exactly. The thing about the thing about Andy Reid, I love about Andy Reid. Like, doesn't matter really who, who he puts back there. But if, they're gonna play. They're gonna play well. If they do let him go, and a certain coach doesn't do well here in Chicago, we'll I'd take love him. to have him here. We'll take him. Now we'll let's speaking him. of that. Let's go to the NFC North. Yeah, uh, there's a no brainer to me. I think the Packers are gonna win the division. Uh, I don't see anybody beating them. Uh, uh, everybody went loaded up. Can't beat these guys. I think the Packers aren't going to win the division this Who's year. Who's going to win it? I actually going with the Bears. Homer. That's a Homer pick. Nah. You in no way, shape, and listen, man. I'm I, not going to. Man, look, man, we yeah. talk a lot. Yeah. And you are a bright guy. Yeah. I, I, I take your lead on a lot of stuff, young yeah. man. But you're not going to sit up here and get me to believe. Let's just say you're doing this to spark controversy on the radio. Because you do not in your heart believe that the Bears are going to win I, win the division. I like the Bears right now. No way. And the thing about no it, way. you know, I do I do I like the, the the Packers? Of course I like the Packers. I think it's going to be one, two. I think it's going to be close. Too many questions. I think I think, I think think the Packers are going to lose a couple games. Too many questions on the offensive line. Okay. Too many questions in the defensive okay, secondary. Okay, and, the Packers, and guess too what? Many, the Packers listen, offensive line listen, ain't that great either. Too many, Go ahead. Yeah, but the Packers offensive line ain't been great for the past two, three years, and Aaron Rodgers has still lit the league up. Yeah, I know. But Jay Cutler hasn't lit the league up without, with a bad offensive line in Chicago. M- Mike Martz is gone. Listen. Go ahead. Listen. Listen. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying that the Bears are not going to be a good team, but to win the division, it's going to take more than what they have. I don't like Look. the Bears secondary and the fact the question mark of Brian Erlacher. If he doesn't play a lot of games, okay. they're going to be in trouble. I can give you that because we talked about that last week. Right. But here's the thing. I think with the easy schedule that the Bears, Packers, I mean, the whole NFC North division has an easy schedule because outside of playing inside the division, exactly. they're playing against the uh, NFC West, I believe. And I yeah, and the Bears always find a way to lose a game to Seattle or somebody like so, that. Right. They always find and a way. And then I think they're playing also like the uh, the AFC West. So right. the two of the weaker divisions or the AFC South, I'm sorry, the South. Or the South. The South and the West. The two of the weakest divisions in football were playing. So it's gonna take it's gonna take maybe twelve wins to win this division. I think the I think the Bears, the uh Packers, and the Lions all will be in that range this year. I think the Bears. Now gonna, I think they're gonna I have a the, letdown this year. I, I don't think so. I think the Bears. I think the, Detroit, I think the Bears are gonna get. No, them. I mean I think the Detroit Lions are gonna have a letdown this year. Oh, the, oh, the Lions. I don't think they're gonna. Don't say that because Matthew Stafford is my quarterback in fantasy football. No, I think they're going to have a letdown. Saying, you know, I think they're going to have a letdown. I just want to let you know. I think you, So I have Packers. You have Bears winning right. the division. Go ahead, South. NFC South, uh, I have the Saints winning that division. I have the Falcons. I think the Falcons. Another homer pick. Hey, man. <laughs> now, <laughs> Nate, where did he say he played football at his last senior year? Where, 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 where'd where you play it? Atlanta. But. Homer pick. No, it's not a homer pick. Now, look at this, man. Great talent. A lot of talent. Out. I think Roddy. Julio Jones. I think Julio Jones in the come. Like, this is his can year Michael right here. Can Michael Turner last the whole season? I think he can. I think he can. What I about like, the I like defense? the offense. Defense, they got uh, two good cornerbacks. Wait a minute. Think yeah. about it. Asante Samuel. Yeah, he's there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Asante yeah. Samuel and... um, Doesn't matter. No, the other guy's good, too. He's going to get paid this offseason. season. I think they have a decent offense. It's a defense. All, uh, look, I, think, you, it's, I think it, it all comes down to the head-to-head between the Falcons Matt and Ryan the Matt Ryan has to live up to the hype this year. Okay. And I believe he will. But we, but listen, the reason 29 why 29 touchdowns last year? You, you, I don't have enough time to rattle off all the, the breeze. 
Oh, no. Okay. The Breeze. I'm that, that's all I'm saying. But what I'm saying is this. Mm-hmm. The Saints' backs are against the wall this year. Mm-hmm. They went through a lot in the offseason. Mm-hmm. They're going to circle the wagons. Okay. And Drew Brees... Pay, pay's not that, so let's. You could basically say that Drew Brees is going to be running the show, okay. As far as offense goes, okay. This is not going to be a problem for him. The Saints are going to do what they do, throw the ball around, get Darren Sproles involved. Uh, 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 they have Ingram. They mm-hmm. have a nice. They got a running game. Uh, one of the best tight ends in the game, right? Doing the thing, and I like Gonzalez, in it, but once again, old, old guy, long in the tooth. This, this Saints team is going to be old. K, and okay. they're going to win the division. I like the Falcons. Veteran leadership. Ryan still has to show me that he's the man. Uh, NFC West, should we even talk about that right now? Yeah, the 49. Okay. Going on to your wild card picks. That's, that's okay. <laughs> Going on to your wild card picks. Wild card picks, I have the Bears and the Giants. Okay, I have the Packers and the Eagles. Basically, your other two teams. Yeah, your other two teams. Yeah, yeah, I have the Bears and the Giants, and I think the Bears playing out of a wild card spot like the Giants could be scary. Yes, it could. But, but at the end of the day... Um, if you want to uh, put a nice little pretty bow on this, who you got going to the Super Bowl, my friend? Uh, that was so tough. But I picked out of the AFC. Who do you got? <laughs> the Ravens. They're gonna do it this year. They're Every year it's the Ravens, year. ain't it? They're like everyone they, wants. They're gonna do it. We this want because you want Ray Lewis to get another ring. Yeah, I, I, I love Ray. Because you love you love Ray, you know more now than before when he was Murder Ray. Now he's a lovable Ray Lewis. You know what I'm saying? Now, now everyone wants to see the, the kind of lovable murder ray. <laughs> they want to see the kind of lovable old vet my get Super a ring. Bowl, my Super Bowl is a battle of the brothers. It's gonna be hardballs in the Super Bowl. Okay, Ravens 49ers. All right, battle of Smash Mouth football at its best. A mm-hmm. couple of old heads with a chance, one to, with a chance to win another title in Ray Lewis, okay. and one with a chance to get his first title in a, in a Randy Moss. Okay. San Francisco 49ers. So I'm Battle of the Brothers for the Super Bowl. Okay, well, okay. Will that be the first time that has ever happened in NFL history? Yeah, they tried to have it happen last year and they just, just couldn't get it together. I think it's going to happen this year. I think they, didn't, they, didn't they coach the Pro Bowl? That was the first time that, that, was the first yeah. time that ever happened. I they, think it's going to happen this year. Harbaugh's coached the, the Pro Bowl. That was exciting. Um, <laughs> AFC East, I'm going New England Patriots to make the Super Bowl, bro. Uh, back-to-back years. And uh, I believe that they will be going up against the Packers this year like they were supposed to last year. Packers, New England. But you don't have the Packers winning the division. And what's your point? So the Packers are going to come from the wild card and do it. Yep. Nah. Yep. Whoever comes from the, from the, from the, I, I believe you're going to have to come from home. This um, year. dog. Packers ain't going on the. I know the Packers won the, the championship last time. Yeah. Okay. From the wild card position. Yeah, they ain't going to happen. Actually, the last three have come from the wild card position. If we go from the wild card, I'm going to put my money on the G men to do it from the wild card. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, the G men can't do it from uh, from a number one spot. They need to be on the yeah, road. They can't. Be on the road. They can't. They That's can't. what I feel like. The Bears have to be like an on the road team to do it. I don't think they could do it from home either. <sighs> yeah. That stadium is the worst looking stadium ever. I said it. Chicago. Oh yeah, especially especially Get at the end of the year. Mad at me with the especially at the end of the with year. The greenhouse sticking out the side. Uh, coming up, we're gonna be talking about our picks. Picks for this week. Oh yeah. Picture this Football week. this week, man. And I'm thinking about them wing stop wings with that rub on. I keep looking at the picture. It's <laughs> and, delicious. And then at the end, at the very end, I mean, at the very We're end. talk about the catches? Yeah. Even though I think you still should have had, like, this other thing. In uh, uh, you know. It's all good. We'll talk about it, man. Coming up on Sports Unplugged, man, we get into the NFL games for the week. We're going to pick five of them. Yeah. Man, man, we're going to keep track. And you can keep track with us, too. All you got to do is go to WGCI.com. Click on the Sports Unplugged link. Who y'all? You in the mix? Follow us on Twitter yeah. at Leon Rogers. At Big Med. At Big Med. All right. Right now, what we got coming up? Ah, uh, stay scheming. Stay scheming, my man Rick Ross, French Montana, and Drizzy Drake. This is the whole song. Well, you know, Drake was firing shots at Common. Common had to make. Oh uh, yeah. Song at, Sweet. And had to had to just end all that. Yeah. Canada Drive. Mm. Sports on. Brought to you by Wingstop. Hey. I repeat all the real things worldwide. Salute. Salute. Real.